This, if you're a fan like me, Yula Guita's Steptoe and Son is among the best sitcoms ever. So do you want to join me today? Grab a chair, sit by the campfire, and we'll live this great show together. We'll travel through the entire cast, past and present, reminiscing about those who have left us and celebrating those who still shine. Are you ready? Let's dive in and rekindle some incredible memories. Yutha Joyce played the character Avis in the sitcom when she was 36 in 1963. Sadly, on August 24, 1980, she left us due to cirrhosis of the liver at the age of 53 in Marybone, London, England. We are deeply saddened by her passing. Go. <laughs> Would you uh, care for a drink? Uh, yes, I'll have a Manhattan. No problem. <laughs> well, I think this is universal, isn't it? The husband and wife, the battle of the sexes is, mm. you know, sort of uh, goes on all over the place. Mm. How much of the parts was written for you? Frank Thornton played the character Barman in the sitcom when he was 41 in 1962. Sadly, on March 16, 2013, he left us of natural causes at 92 in Barnes, London, England. We are deeply saddened by his passing. A bit quick enough. <laughs> you put me in. Uh, stepped up. I've come to pay off the balance. Stepped up. Harold. Excuse me. British seaside postcard humour. You know, it's as simple as that. You know, with a cast of good actors. And yeah, that's why. Damaris Heyman played the character Cashier in the sitcom when she was 35 in 1964. Sadly, on June 3rd, 2021, she left us due to cirrhosis of the liver at 91 in Gloucestershire, England. We are deeply saddened by his passing. Hey, Mrs. What's the name of the bird played in Lost Horizon? Jane Wyatt. That's right. Did you see Lost Horizon? Oh, yes. Lovely picture. <laughs> and there was a bit in episode three, I think. Wilfred Brambell played the character Albert Steptoe in the sitcom when he was 50 years old in 1962. Sadly, on January 18, 1985, he left us due to cancer at 72 in London, England. We are deeply saddened by his passing. Well, that's not true either. That was me and your grandfather. He's trying to get the credit for everything. He, that article is going to be a tissue of lies. We only met when we were working. Because we lived different lives and miles apart. I, as you know, have a two-room... Anthony Sharp played the character Vicar in the sitcom when he was 55 in 1970. Sadly, on July 23rd, 1984, he left us of natural causes at 69 in London, England. We are deeply saddened by his passing. ...isn't of the problem. However... Yes, do go on, Vicar. So we have decided to publish a special centenary edition of our Paris magazine. Mm. Yeah, that's right. Last two years. He shot her. The man who deserted her. The man who forced her to... Harry H. Corbett played the character Harold Steptoe in the sitcom when he was 37 in 1962. Sadly, on March 21st, 1982, he left us of a heart attack at 57. In Hastings, it's a sex England. We're deeply saddened by his passing. The merits and the meanings of the word bum. <laughs> I don't use dirty words like that. My bum's not dirty! <laughs> I mean... ...here, from an actor, is my character wouldn't do this. Then he's finished. That means his character is tight and narrow like that. Yeah. Now, in the step toe, one week I will depend, be defending. Molly Sugden played the character Auntie Minnie in the sitcom when she was 43 in 1965. Sadly, on July 1st, 2009, she left us due to cirrhosis of the liver at 86 in Guilford, Surrey, England. We are deeply saddened by her passing. Hello, Albert. Oh, hello, Minnie. He didn't suffer, you know. Didn't he? No, went out like a light. Went the way he wanted to. More insulting. And, uh, but they didn't mind if you did that. They, they... I have to talk about your clothing. You are beautifully attired. Leonard Rossiter played the character Johnny Spooner in the sitcom when he was 38 in 1964. Sadly, on October 5th, 1984, he left us due to hypertrophic cardiomyopathy at 57 
at the Reserve Theatre, London, England. We are deeply saddened by his passing. Just where I just come from. Yes, of course. I'm so sorry. Oh, all right. Yeah. Something that I could do well because everybody seemed to think I was quite good at it. And uh, I enjoyed it, so I, I, I couldn't think of anything better. Dudley Foster played the character Carl Salzman in the sitcom when he was 39 in 1963. Sadly, on January 8, 1973, he left us due to a stroke at 48 in Hampstead, London, England. We are deeply saddened by his passing. Really? Five skinheads in the Pakistan. Norman Bird played the character bank manager in the sitcom when he was 46 in 1970. Sadly, on April 22, 2005, he left us due to cancer at 80 years old in Wolverhampton, England. We are deeply saddened by his passing. Recovery business. <laughs> ah, yes, yes, an expanding industry and saving the country millions of valuable dollars on the import of raw material. Colin Gordon played the character Mr. Greenwood in the sitcom when he was 51 in 1962. Sadly, on October 4, 1972, he left us with liver cancer at 61 in Housemere, Surrey, England. We are deeply saddened by his passing. Inland revenue. So you, you, you must be the gentleman they wrote to my father about. That's right. Are your parents in? My, my, my father's in. He's waiting. George A. Cooper played the character Uncle Arthur in the sitcom when he was 40 years old in 1965. Sadly, on November 16, 2018, he left us of natural causes at 93 in Leeds, Hampshire, England. We are deeply saddened by his passing. Albert? Mm, so it is you, is it? Look, I've had a great deal of personal expense. I'm entitled to the divvy. The insurance policy did not cover the entire cost of the insurance. John Newell played the character Anne Ethel in the sitcom when she was 48 in 1963. Sadly, on November 1st, 2012, she left us due to cirrhosis of the liver at 97 in Danville House, Northwood, London, UK. We are deeply saddened by her passing. <laughs> I can understand, you know, what Harold's mother went through now, I can. Oh, yes, well, I'm not going through it. You're not going to put me into an early grave. Ah, will you? Okay, let's chat. Who is your favorite character in Steptoe and Son? Please comment and share interesting things below this video. And as always, show some love. Hit the like button, subscribe for more, and hit the bell to never miss my new content. I can't wait to create more wonderful memories with you. Thanks so much and stay tuned for more. See you again as soon as possible.